Kia ora, this is Off Grid Native. Today what we're doing is rendering down shark liver oil. This came off a hammerhead shark of a net that I set. There's two of these and I uh, always try and utilise anything that um, dies. You know, even if it's unnecessary, I try and utilise it, bring it back home and make something out of it. So I'll be making shark liver oil out of this and then I'll be mixing it with red iron oxide earth, kokowai and then making a uh, traditional paint out of it. So pretty much what we're going to do is just chuck this on the fire. We've got the fire going in the back. Uh, you don't want it too hot. You're not adding any water. You're chucking it on like this. And then all of the oil will come out of the liver. And uh, it'll just boil away. If your fire is too hot, you'll find it'll start to get quite dark and charcoal in it. And that'll change the colour of your oil to a dark burnt sort of consistency whereas if you do it and keep the heat right it'll be a nice yellow so we're going to chuck that on the fire and um, watch that and come back a bit later on here I'm collecting kokowai red earth the oil is cooled and I'm putting it into a jar I'm going to chuck the excess on the fire and you can see um how flammable the shark liver oil is. We've got our rock for mixing, a bowl to mix up our kokowai and our shark liver oil. We've got our kokowai here, which is our red earth. And in here, we've got our shark liver oil. Once we've got that ground down, we're going to add our shark liver oil. You don't want it too dry and you don't want it too runny. That's about the consistency that I'm going to go for. Now this is a time where you would use a mordant, and a mordant is a fixative that helps the paint stick to stick to what you're putting it to. So it could be something like puro puro, not the boil up one, the other one. If you know your puro puro, um, angi angi manuka, all of those are mordants, and you lay down your mordant first, and then you apply your your paint to it, and that'll help it stick. So this is what we got here. That's our cocoa white, and I'm um, just going to start painting the painting around the outside of the doors. The thing I'm doing today. Kia ora lo. That was off grid native, and that was uh, making shark liver oil, mixing it with cocoa white, red ox iron oxide earth, and making a paint. So what you want to remember is rendering's a good skill to have in your belt as a survival skill because you can make cooking oil you can make flammable liquid for fire torches, candles you can make a fixative for fixing paint stew and you can make a fixative to put plant medicine rongwa and you can put it on things so here's all those skills so it's a good one to have in your belt uh, we're coastal people so we're going to use the shark liver oil if you're inland you're probably going to use something like bird fat but um you could use dripping or something if you're in a town. But uh, anyway, I just want to give a big mihi to all of the people that are following and giving positive comments out there and um, enjoying it. So, yep, kia ora. Be aware, whanau.